got some super awesome news. I have a pre-update. I have a pre-update. I have a pre-update. I'm so excited. I have a pre-update for October 25th. So my coordinator said that she would like to have me have surgery by November because soon after that we will be moving. Just a few more months. Hence the reason I'm actually outside right now because my usual filming area has been taken over by boxes and whatnot. So while I work on that, I'm going to film outside or wherever it is that I can find, but I will be putting out a video every single week. Not only do I have a pre-update, but I also have most of my hospital bag ready. It's a huge bag. I got it at Target. Um, I left the sticker on because the price on this is ridiculously awesome. It's on clearance at Target for $17.48. Plus, there was a coupon on Cartwheel for 20% off. And I used my red card. So I got it down to like $13. So not bad. It's a pretty big bag. Not that I'm going to need all the space because I am a very light packer. I'd rather not bring too much stuff if I can. Here's what I have in my hospital bag. Alright. This is the bulk of what's in my hospital bag. So I could have technically just brought this thing with me. I have... A little tiny jar of chapstick, some shampoo. I brought hygiene things, not because I'm expecting to shower, but if there is a chance that I can, then great. I'd rather have it than go without because showers are uplifting and they make me feel like a brand new person. So, hence I brought a little travel thing of shower gel and conditioner. More chapstick because I'm always losing it and I'm the type of person whose lips are naturally chapped. So I'm not trying to be like dying and I hear that chapped lips after surgery is ridiculous. So a sleeping mask because I can't deal with all the lights in the hospital. It has to be pitch dark for me to be able to sleep. This is a mask. I got these at Target on clearance. They're two seventy eight with my red card. I got it down to like maybe two dollars and twenty five cents. They have the grips on the bottom, but these I'm not planning to use to walk around the hospital. I'm using them just to lay around in bed. I'm not going to use them to walk around the hospital, even though they have the non-slip bottom, because of the fact that I'm not trying to get into bed with socks that I've dragged throughout the entire hospital. So these are just for my feet. Whatever. I have one thing left to complete my bag. Those are slip-on sandals. That's what I'm going to be using to walk around the hospital. Um, and they're pink. So those are coming in. Amazon, get your game together. Um, prime shipping to Hawaii sucks really bad. Like, not even kidding. I ordered those like a week and a half ago. And it's prime shipping. Alright, so these. They are really old and ratty because they're my husband's and I stole them from him. But they're brand new. They're still in the plastic earplugs because not hospital noises tend to wake me up so I've got that. Last but not least I have my nightgown. It's a cute little nightgown I got at Target. Yeah I get pretty much everything at Target. So I got this nightgown at Target. I love it because it's also like a cute little dress thing and my kids confuse it with a dress. So I'm thinking I can wear it as a nightgown and I can wear it home and won't be touching anything. Um, last minute items that I'm going to pack are going to be my blanket scarf that I got in my FabFitFun box this month um, that's currently inside my house. But um, the other thing that I'm going to pack is a pillow. I hear it's just wrap a pillow around your belly and on your way home from the hospital you should be good. Alright, down to stats. This week I weighed in at 243. Um, at this point, as long as I'm maintaining, they're happy with me. My goal weight for surgery is 240. I should be getting surgery next month, so that's three pounds to go for surgery. And I am loving it. Right now, I am about to go out and have some fun with my girlies um, from my support group. And I am going to have a ladies night. Come here, Ariana. This heel is my at-home support. Say hi. Hi. What's your name? Ariana. Yes. This is my six-year-old. Is Mama having surgery next month? Yeah. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. Mom get healthy? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, she's upset with me because I'm going out for ladies night, aren't you? Yeah. But that's okay, right? Get over it. <laughs> 
<laughs> all right so i am going to cut this short i'm probably going to insert a little bit of footage for my ladies Everybody. Well, I have them made it to girls' night, and it's time for this little lady to have fun. week with an update on my third psychology appointment so next week I have my third psychology appointment the week after that is my pre-op appointment I have a pre-op appointment all right so I will see you guys next Saturday have a wonderful weekend and bye bye till next time mahalo bye. and aloha, aloha. <laughs> Wait a minute, before you guys go, be sure you hit that subscribe button. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I had a lot of fun. And stay tuned, another video coming up next week Saturday. As always, mahalo and aloha.